to the Swan Road. Can't raise the sail here. Let's have a song. Your salt scores got a story? Who not a deal and sailor who could pilot a longship entirely on This is why King Sigvaldi in all other matters, who not a man. He was one of the most unlikable people I have ever known. One needed some curls from the Ingling clan to dine with us. As we were serving ale, we came to find that we had none left. It so happened that the ale had run out just before reaching Unar's hall. This a word storm, and he accused Sigvaldi of treachery. Every man in the longhouse of raising such a fuss. This made U for, and he stormed out. A short time later, we heard him yelling through the door of the hall. I said this! Now you pay for your sins! It's the Danes. It's the damn Danes. Make them pay their guilt for the dead that now litter the fields. Show sense, please. What would the Danes gain from the slaughter of poor farmers? Look! There's a filthy Dane now! Why don't we ask? Oh, my best milk cow, you beast! Yeah. 
not touch your herd. The walls are making this worse. These Saxons fight like mad dog down. I cannot blame them. Stay in your hand, stranger. What is your name? Of the Raven Clan in Mercia. Wolfhilda, abbess and inquirer into mysteries. Are we here for the same reason, I wonder? Ah, uh, to look up all's work. But why would a Dane from Upriver care what happens to Saxon farmers? If there's a rabid wolf or bear on the prowl, I'd see it blame often falls on... And good, Eivor of the Raven Clan. Take a look at the mall and tell me what manner of rabid beast did these things. I could start with the dead cows. Bite marks, but not from any beast I know. And the corpse is covered in strange mold. Though the wish. You there? Poor beast. Danes befell it. You be sure? It was Rothgar's war band. They're holed up in that old church, working their misery upon us. Warriors do not often go about slaying milk cows. Besides, I have heard talk of a beast on the loose. A Jotun did this. I'm sorry. Stuck it. Problems for getting so close. I it happened. I saw it all. What? A wolf? A bear? Maybe a rabbit hound? It was a Jotun. There's a tree. And it laughed rip hair. It yelled out its name. Grendel. A Jotun did this. He saw it all big and hairy. Stuck out the moor. Giants aren't real. You saw the devil. Blood still wet as dew. Where does it lead? By the gods, manner of beast flung that bear to its doom. What sort of beast leaves glistening mold over freshly killed prey? Yet that woman blamed the Rothgar and his band of Danes were the killer's men. Whatever it was, they were mighty enough to get a mauled beast onto a rooftop. But that little girl said giant, calling itself Grendel. This may be the work of a band of drunken Danes. Or worse. I should discuss these clues with Wolfhilda. Wolfhilda, I have learned all I can from the villagers, and that's. And what is your take on the? Still, a wolf or bear did these things. This is not the work of a wooder. The bite marks, the mold, most art. So you admit this is the devil's work? Or one of your wooden dragons come to life? A few maulings do not make for a devil or a dragon. It must be a man or a pack of them. The girl mentioned a name, Grendel. No, no mortal hand could rend flesh in such a way. Surely you see that. I have seen the worst the hands of men can do. Deeds bloodier than this. And these men stalk the night, slaying cattle as they go. True. This thing I cannot explain. Three times these attacks have happened. Each time, bite marks, broken bones of mole. Wicked walks in East Anglia. Some are attacked in the woods northeast of here. This way, we may find. <laughs> Should be up there in the trees ahead. Can you smell it? It reeks of death and evil. I know that scent well. Carrion and death. Loki's reek.
Kings have drawn in a starving wolf pack. <laughs> I'm unhurt. Thank you, Dane. I missed you. Neat, but tell me what happened. The beasts came scavenging for fresh meat. I meant, why are you out here with the dead cattle again? I'm searching for my best milch cow. She's missing. And you found her? No, but I found a Danish axe. It belongs to Rothgar, leader of... You know for a fact this axe is his? <laughs> yes. He brandishes it about the village, demanding ale. I was Rothgar and his warband. Woman in a nearby band of war mornings. No other clues. I know the men she means. They're staying at the church near the farm. Come, them. Their leader, a great man. He is no cattle killer. You have curious opinions, Wilhilda, that uncommonly open mind. I should say the same of you. Most heathens would point to witchcraft or monsters. But you seek an earthly cause. I have seen many strange things, but the answers are usually close at hand, if only hidden. True. Yet in this search to explain the unexplainable, that I'm's in unholy Which accepts this. They rate it. That is a deceiver. Self works in mist. So I too must have possibilities and tolerate like me. Or that and stand within the street. Stand. This is war work. Car and his men. They. Careful, Vilda. The killer may yet linger here. Their leader. Not see him among the dead. Bye. See more fresh mold in the cows. The villagers say it is Mark. Huh. What do you say, Eivor? I say find the mold. They marks us before. It marks and mauling. These are not weapon wounds. Man of the fellows. Someone crawled into the loft. Dear. Back you. I can You are Rothgar, leader of this warband. I am. A Finnmark raider of it. <laughs> For the little time I have left. I bear ill news. Your warriors have fallen. Who or what did this? Thing. The monster did this thing. It killed us while lo love. It broke my axe and gouged me. <coughs> I crawled up here to die. <coughs> what was it? Did you see? A foul Jotun. A night goer from the world's rim. It spoke. Named itself Grendel. Said it would return. <coughs> Good. We shall wait for it to come back, you and I. I, my wounds are too great. My spirit takes ship. Send them to Hailheim. Ride with the winged women, friend. I will handle this grand, whatever manner of monster it may be. Wait, warrior. <laughs> to. Do not scan it returns. It will wait to show itself again. Rest. Step prayer. Be 
still. to make Grendel hurt. Mama, I want to go home. I... Bright, what roof is that? Not a monster. Strange to behold, but this... Grendel is... was... a man. All men have mothers. This one called out for his. In the Even the most hideous fools, O oh Lord, forgive man his sins, grant grace. Mold everywhere. I'll follow this trail. Eternal rhythm, O oh Lord, and let perpetual light shine upon them. All these souls rest in peace. Grendel must have tracked this mob, but from where? Trail leads southwest. of the mold must be near. into this pit. speaks of her child, Grendel. Cruel fate the gods have woven. Malevolence. This land bears deep affliction. Oh. 
mold. Just mold. Sending visions like a... You... You smell like my son. My son's blood. Where is he? Where is my boy? about the Danes. To protect my boy. He never meant to hurt anyone. But the others, they could not see. He, he kept growing in body, but not in mind. He was my boy. Sweet little Gretel. David.
Abbas. A4, you live yet. Pray, tell all. I slew a monster that was but a man. Then I tracked his mother and killed her too. His mother? She struck at me in the dark and I defended myself. But it was no hero's deed. Those poor souls. I shall pray for them tonight at Barking Abbey. Leaving already? I must. The bishop is eager for a full accounting of the Beast of East Anglia. Leave my name out of your tale. It is nothing to be remembered for. Understood. Perhaps it would work better as a song. I dabbled in verse as a youth. It may be time to lift the pen again. But what story shall I write? The full truth of this thing may be hard to fathom. Give them a comforting one about heroes and monsters. For the truth, the bone-cold truth of everything is often hard to take. It cuts like a cruel north wind on the neck. God saves us all, A4. I take my leave now, but will write to you once my poem is complete. Farewell. Thank you, and farewell to you too, Wolfhilda. Make it a good tale.